Greylock 2 is an open source log management system that allows you to capture and analyze all log messages that your systems generate. And now it can also read AWS CloudTrail logs. This allows you to make any change to your AWS infrastructure visible and correlate those change events to other events across your systems. Sudden increase of load on a web server, see you made changes to a load balancer with just a click. Creating a new CloudTrail input is easy. It really just needs a title, the credentials of an IAM user, an SQS queue name, and information about the AWS region in which you want to listen for CloudTrail events. This is all documented on our website and should never take longer than five minutes. Imagine you're running a website on AWS infrastructure and suddenly it's not reachable anymore. Somebody on your team might have done a change, but you're the one who's responsible for running it. So now it's your time to find out what's going on here. One of the first things you might want to look at is of course the error logs from your application. But imagine there's just nothing going on. It looks like there are no connections coming onto it anymore. So next thing to check is, were there any changes to your AWS infrastructure? So we go in here and say, show me everything from AWS CloudTrail that somehow includes the term greylock2.org, which is the website that you're running. Execute the search. And yep, you see on Thursday and Friday, somebody did changes to infrastructure that's related to greylock2.org. So let's see what was going on here. Let's go into the event source and dig a bit deeper into this. And we see that all events that happened here are coming from the Elastic Load Balancing Service. So it looks like somebody did changes to your load balancing infrastructure. Let's dig a bit deeper and say, let's see what event names were actually happening here. You see there were some describe events, that's always fine. But uh -huh, somebody called configure health check, deregister instance from load balancer and register instance with load balancer. So somebody was changing which Amazon instances are bound to your load balancer. That might be the reason here. So go into the username, click on the quick values, and we see there was only one user that did all the changes. So probably the one we should talk to. And by using our real-time stream matching feature, you can even set up alerts and outputs to react on certain events or numbers of events in real time. Then you can also go to dashboards and easily create own dashboards that give you an overview about what's happening in your infrastructure right now. Because of all the information that is included in the log messages, the use cases are sheer endless. This is why the best way to go on from here is probably to download Greylock 2, run it in your own infrastructure and play around with it yourself. It's all free, it's all open source. You can start with it right now if you want.